Okay guys, so hello and welcome back to Resident Evil 3. The last video we fought Nemesis again. Jill got infected and uh, Carlos carried her here to the hospital to see if he could find a vaccine. Uh, we're fixing to continue on and search this hospital. Hopefully we can find a, a uh, vaccine for Jill. Um, as of right now, we really don't have anything that's going to help her. Um, Darryl, where's Bard now? Gotta be the lab in the back. Stay frosty, I'm on my way. Copy. I'll go on ahead. I get the feeling we're gonna be dealing with more zombies in here. I mean, it wouldn't be Resident Evil if we if we didn't have to deal with them. Um, let's see. I think I'm gonna have to go through that door back over there. There's a lock there. Uh, let's see. I could get through here. Let me see if I can go through here. I may have to find some. Nope, okay. Not even bolt cutters will help with that door. I'm not looking forward to doing this. And there's the zombies. Okay. I guess, uh, guess we better get to it. Okay, let's take them down. Oh, hang on a second. Hang on, hang on, hang on a second, man. Back up. Okay. I have got to make sure I am. I don't got time for this. Oh, there's somebody. Oh, there's another one trying to break in through there. Yep. Okay. Okay, that's not working. Okay, she's only got one leg, so. Oh, I'm out of... Oh, no. I'm out of handgun ammo. That is not good. And I'm getting low there. Okay, I've got to be... i got to use this ammo sparingly. But, of course, I know they're going to be throwing all kind of zombies at me. Let me go back this way and look around real quick. What do we got here? Lockpick. Okay. Jill? Was the only one that had the lockpick? I don't think. I can pick it up with Carlos. Let me just... Let me just look, just to be sure. Okay, ID card and first aid spray. Let me go ahead and put one of these up. Put that up. Move this up here. Okay, we got a lot of inventory space. And I gotta go back through this door. I don't know that I'm... Really gonna like this part. Oh, wait. Okay, so that's just the indicator that there's something right there. Okay, I'm, I'm not going to sprint just yet. I kind of slow it down. Welcome to the office of Dr. Nathaniel Bard. Please state your business clearly into the intercom. Okay, before we do that, let me check this out. Oh, wait. There's no tape in it. Okay. Man, that's an old school tape player. Every day they bring in more of those mysterious mystery illness patients. The sedatives don't stop their 
delirium. So we have to put them in straight jackets and move them to the isolation wing. Problem is, the isolation wing is already bursting at the seams. The director has ordered us to admit anyone with symptoms free of charge, but we, do, but what he doesn't, what he does, hang on, but what does he expect us to do? I cannot read. Wish them better. We don't have a cure, and that's not all that's bothering me. When these patients die, they're not, they're not collected by the usual mortary teams. We've been told it's special handling to prevent the illness from spreading, but I'm not sure I buy it. Miranda saw some guys willing a body through the forbidden door during the night. Why? Where? What is going on? Um, nothing you probably want to know about. Actually, they're, they're, they're probably being tested on and being resurrected because they're becoming zombies. What's back here? Nope, 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 nope. nope. I'm not going to deal with that right now. Probably going to have to go through there anyway. Of course. Dr. Bard, are you in there? I'm here to rescue you. Open the door. No voice match found. Voice match? What kind of sci-fi bullshit is this? Terrific. Okay, we're going to have to... Oh, that didn't work. Oh, excuse me. Oh, no. Okay, I'm about to get grabbed. Oh, don't mind me. I'm just... Minding my own business. I wanted to open that crate back there, but I don't have the ammo to fight them right now. Oh, oh, oh. Pulling out a gun that don't have no ammo in it. I don't like how quiet it, it is in here. Okay, uh, I need to be looking around. I don't like how he's sitting there. Let's, let's move on. Handgun ammo. Nice. Okay. Let's reload that gun. Um. Hang on before we go through there. Let me check and make sure there's nothing back here. Okay. Not this way. Whoa. Whoa. I did not want to hop down here just yet. Okay, maybe I did. What is this? A key. A key to what? Okay, how do I get back? Okay, nice. Got some more assault rifle ammo. I can now... I don't know what I can do now. I, I mean, I, don't, I really don't know what this key is, is for. Oh, look at you. Why am I not... Thought I heard this in here a minute ago. Okay. Had to make sure he was dead because 
they will grab you if you run back through here and they're they're pretending to be dead. Okay, let's see what's in here. Got a safe safe room. Hang on, I didn't want to do that just yet. Admitted over 20 mystery illness patients. Patients in the isolation wing exhibiting severe limb fever muttering and signs of hypo possible infection tried everything still no blood work back to the research wing okay um, handgun ammo Okay, let me go on ahead. Oh, there's a green herd there. Um, let's put that up and that up for now. We're gonna move that over here. Here, I'm gonna keep at least two things of health on me. Let's go ahead and save this. Okay. What is this? A map? Nice. Okay. Staff room through here. Okay. I have not been in here yet. Something really bad went down in here. Oh, there's bodies everywhere. Nurse's journal. We tried, I swear to God we did, but there's nothing else to be done. The chaos is completely beyond control. Victims are pro pouring in now, dying and spreading the infection faster than we can reach them. So we're giving up trying. Those of us who aren't infected have barricaded ourselves in here. We can hear the cries for help outside, the screaming, but none of us will go out there because it will be the end of us. I can't believe we abandoned our patients. It's the, it's the worst sin imaginable for a nurse. I can't stop shaking, but I want to live. I want to live. We heard a helicopter flying overhead and immediately started crying and hugging each other, thinking our rescue team was on the way, but then the sound grew distant. And all we're left with now is the moaning of the dead and the silent screams in our head. We're about we're all about to lose our minds. Dr. Young Ariana Miranda Dakota, I'm sorry I failed you. Something's coming. Help. Oh, and then I guess that was it. Memos for administration. ID cards are not to be taken off hospital guards under any circumstances as per security measures. All employees must store their ID card in their own personal lockers before returning home for the day. The key to the locker room has been missing. The last person to have it may, be, may have dropped it somewhere in the courtyard. Until it is recovered, we will keep a spare key here in the office. Please stop by administration at the end of your shift to borrow it. Oh, this is where this comes into play. Nice. Okay, so now I gotta find a spare key. A flashbang. Oh, God, I knew that was gonna happen. Same jump scare from the second one. <sighs> the sad part is I knew that was gonna happen. Okay, we're booking it.
Oh my goodness, what is this? Okay, come on. Oh my goodness. The bad thing is, is I'm pretty sure there's going to be more of those things. Okay, where do I got to go? Search for an auto cassette. Okay. So I've got the ID card. Was it right here? I'm going to save it one more time. Yeah, I get the feeling that whatever that was that I just ran into, there's going to be several more of those creatures lurking about. And I've not even explored any of this down here. Let me try to get into the nurse's station. I think this is where I went earlier and I couldn't get in here. Well, no. Okay, I can get in here. No, no, I'm gonna, I'm gonna explore for a little bit. Okay, I can't go that way. Let me go back over here. There's a few rooms I've not looked through yet. Oh no. Where's that noise coming from? Was it in here? I really... Oh, man. So... It looks like... I need to go down into here. There's a safe, but I don't have a code to it yet. Wait, what did that say? Note about a tape recording. I think I know what happened to the missing tape of Dr. B. He research, His research assistant took it. One of my new patients saw Abbott removing something from a locker in the nurse's station and walked toward the treatment room. I'll try to sneak in and look during the night shift. You could stay cool and keep doing your job. I don't care how important Dr. B is to the medical community. That kind of harassment is not okay. I promise I won't let them destroy the evidence. He's a pig and an asshole and will get his day in court. Stay brave, stay strong. Okay. Uh oh, sounds like whatever that was just broke through. Yep. I can get rid of that. Oh my goodness, there's more of those creatures. And I'm fixing to have to go in here. Okay. Oh no! Oh, come on. I am dodging. Okay, well, there's one way for me to get through there. <sighs> Wait. Oh, that's that, uh... Oh, well, hello. Did I... Did I... I'm sorry, wrong room. Wrong room!
staff room. There's a lot of areas through here I have not really... Okay, that's... Records room. Okay, staff room. There's something in here I'm missing. Oh, it's that. Okay, I don't have a lockpick. Okay, let me, uh... I guess I really don't have a choice. I need to, uh... I need to just, uh... Go on through this and... Just fight my way through them. I don't have a whole lot of ammo, but I just got to do it. Oh, terrific. No. That's great. Oh. Oh, well. Ah! I don't... The, the mechanic for dodging is... I just can't get it down. Okay, gotta go. This is my chance. Okay, thank you for the headshot. I need a... I don't know what I need. Let me just... Oh, great. I don't have... This is probably where I gotta go, is right through there. Oh, great. I forgot they were right there. Open the door. Can they not open the door? Okay, I think, I think she's dead. Oh, whoa, whoa. Okay, same way. Okay. I may have to make a trip back to the... Oh. Actually, I can do it from right here. Wait, it shows there's some ammo. Oh, right there. Okay, I need to get back to that safe, safe room real quick. I need to... Heal myself. Grab that out of there. Store that. Man, my inventory is not looking looking too good.
Okay, I've explored every everywhere out in this hallway. I need to get into that nurse's station and look around. Okay, I don't have anything out there I can get. Am I missing something in here? I mean... Let me see what that note said about... From the locker in the nurse's sta station and walk toward the treatment room. Okay, let me see. Treatment room, right here. Go through here. And of course, treatment room is where they're at. Oh my. Why can't they just stay dead? Like really? Oh, great. Oh, it's right there. I don't have ammo for this. Okay, guys, I actually uh, had to reload a previous save file. And I've been exploring this hospital. And I've actually made my way into this room. And I have found... The sheet of paper that gives me the combination to the safe. So we're fixing to head over there and get that safe. Which I believe was back in the nurse's station. Which we gotta go upstairs for now. I'm actually back on the first floor. So, um... Just a second. Okay. I uh, had to go and make sure that uh, my mic settings were correct. Because last time I tried to record this, with, when I went and recorded the last video, uh, my mic was picking up. It wasn't picking up with my actual mic. It was picking up on my computer. And I didn't really want to have it like that again. Because it's, it's very hard to hear whenever... The audio is being picked up from the computer. Let me see. I'm headed to the nurse's station. Which I gotta go through here. And then back. Actually, I'm going the wrong way. I need to go right down through here. And straight across, right? Yep. Okay, I've already dealt with all the zombies in here. I've actually got a little more ammo than what I had earlier. Uh, let's see. It was nine clockwise. Oh, that's the wrong way. Okay. Three counterclockwise. Ooh, nice! A dual magazine, okay. Let's go ahead and combine that. Should give me more ammo. Alright, now then, we need to go... Okay, uh... Oh, actually I think I need to... Let's see. Come on. I think that's the door I need to be going through. Yeah, it's right here. Oh, great. Yeah, here we go. We're gonna have to... Let me, let me, uh, actually do something real quick. I can get rid of that now. Actually, I think we'll be, be alright. So, since I've started up another save file, I'll have to deal with these zombies here. Whoa, okay. Yeah. 
Come on, go down now. Come on. There we go. I just get in here so I can deal with them, make sure he's dead, make sure she's dead, okay. Okay, I need to kind of look around in here, there's some assault rifle ammo. Is that everything in here? Let me just make sure, okay, there's a red herb, and I'm going to combine that. I should have went and made a trip to the safe room and saved this before I came back over here. I'm going to go on ahead. Actually, can I make it from here? Let me see where it's at. Okay. I can. I'm going to make it. I'm going to make a run back over here to the safe, safe room. And I'm going to clear out my inventory a little bit and save this. Wait, hang on, that's not what I wanted. Okay, I'm gonna just store that. That's really all I wanted to store for now. Let me save it. Okay, here we go. Now back to... Was... Which room was it? Okay, it's over here. Okay, here we go. I actually read that these are the most effective. Okay, and then... Okay. Whew. Nice. Not so tough now, are you? Actually, I'd, uh... Okay, we got the auto cassette. And I think that's all I need, right? Okay, let's go ahead and combine that. No, right there. Examine. Well, how do I do this? Did I, did I not pick up the auto, the cassette player? I mean, not cassette player, huh? Anything back here in these lockers? I would have, I could have swore I was supposed to examine this. Okay. Let's... Let's just continue to look around, I guess. I mean, I don't know what else to do. Except for, uh... Wait, hang on. Let me go back through this store that I unlocked earlier. And then... We want to go... Oh! Oh, no, 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 no. Oh, I can't... Okay, okay. Hang on. I know how to take you down now. Oh, 
Oh. Okay, we want to go downstairs, so I need to hook this left. Oh no, I didn't need to... Wait, did I? Yeah, I needed to go through the roof. Back down here. Okay, straight across it looks like. Yeah. Man, this is... This has not really been one of my favorite... Wait, how am I supposed to get over there? Huh, hang on. I don't think I went the right way. Oh, good grief. Oh, you gotta be kidding. Well, at least I got, uh, plenty of ammo for this right now. Back up. Okay. No. Man, I said I had plenty of ammo, plenty of ammo, but I'm I'm running low now. Okay. Are we good now? Handgun ammo. Okay, I cannot get into there now. That... Oh, man, that just... That... Escalated... Escalated? Escalated. I was... I don't know if I'm saying the words right. I can't English. Okay, so that's where that guess is. That's where this gets used at, right? All I wanted to know was what the documents were doing in your office in the first place. Who do you think you're talking to? I'm goddamn Nathaniel Bard. I'm the best biologist you'll ever meet, you bedpan changing waste of a nursing degree. Of course I have connections higher up. Okay, what have we got in here now? And it looks like he's dead already. Bard. Tyrell. Bard's dead. He's been shot. Shit. And the vaccine? I'm looking. Well, look harder. There's gotta be a computer, right? What about this? Dear Dr. Barb. It is my pleasure to invite you to a banquet on September 10th at the Central Hotel where we will be exchanging viewpoints on Raccoon City's new special medical zone. Attending will be Mayor Michael Warren, Chief of Police Brian Edwards, Edwards, Brian Irons, and other distinguished members of the, our community. We would be honored if you joined us. I'll be introducing the bill for the new for that new drug of yours in mid-August. Bring the cash. We booked a suite for the usual after party. You're a brunette guy, right? I'll let Irons know. Okay, well it seems like he was taking money under the table. 
Okay, let's see. Is there anything in this room? There's some ammo over here that I ran right past. Now it's right... Right there. Okay. Anything else? I want to look... Make sure I'm not missing anything. Okay. There should be something else in here. Right there. More assault, uh... Assault rifle ammo. Okay. As long as we're good with ammo, that's all that I really need. Email from Nathaniel Barb. Greg, I know you're watching the news. This virus is going to devour the whole country. The dead will be... The dead will wash over Capitol Hill like a tidal wave. You're not safe. However, you've always been a good friend to me, so I'd like to offer you a way out. I have in my possession one dose of a vaccine for the virus, the Holy Grail, and it's not for my family, not for my ladies on this side. No, Greg, I'm saving it for you. I know better than anyone that you're the future of the, Uni future of the United States, but if you want the goods, Greg, you'll have to... You'll have... You have got to get me the hell out of here now without Umbrella finding out. Lean on the Pentagon for me. I know you've got the clout. See if someone can get a rescue team in here without UBCS involvement. You scratch my back, I scratch yours, which should sound pretty... Chase. I don't know if I'm saying that right. After the parties we've been to, hurry, my time is running out. This is VRC Chief Nathaniel Bard, September 29, 11 p.m. I am acutely aware that my time's running out. And I hope and pray by making this recording and bringing the truth to light that I can restore some small shred of honor to my name. All of Raccoon City's suffering began with the release of a biological weapon known as the T-Virus. My employer, the Umbrella Corporation, engineered this virus. And they ordered my team to develop a vaccine, which we did. Now, I keep samples of this vaccine here in my office. The rest of it is stored underground. But those sons of bitches at the board, they want to destroy it. They don't want the world to know what they've done. So they're trying to erase all evidence that the virus ever existed. Now, I'm not a fool. I know they don't want me to... I got you all along. And she trusted me anyway. Fuck! Okay, let's get through this door. Hopefully there's a safe point. Let's go ahead and grab the vaccine, I guess. There it is. Give the vaccine to Jill. Right, Jill. Hang tight. Okay, it just saved. I think this might actually be a good spot to stop this at for now. When we get back, we'll make our way back to Jill and give her the vaccine. Uh, but in the meantime, guys, I hope you enjoyed this, and I will see you next time.